Hi, I'm Russ from Weights and Biases, and today I'll be discussing building agentic AI applications using W&B Weave. Before we go any further, let's define AI agents. Agents are autonomous AI systems, meaning that they act on their own without human direction or oversight, allowing them to function entirely independently. They plan and execute multi-step tasks in a loop. While often guided by a plan generated when launched, Tasks are often initiated and executed in a cyclical rather than linear manner, depending on the job that needs to get done. Agents use memory and tools while they operate to expand their capabilities and enhance their ability to perform complex jobs autonomously. And finally, agents understand their end goal and continue to work until it's been achieved. On the right here, we have a simple high-level chart depicting an agentic workflow. An end user interacts with the agent perhaps by asking a question. The agent considers the question and generates a plan of action. The plan involves multiple steps and continues as needed. And finally, when the job is done, the agent concludes its work. Now that we know what an agent is, let's take a look at an agent in action. This is a financial analyst dashboard where we can quickly check stock quotes and market performance. We'll avoid singling out any stocks for the sake of the demo and focus on the NASDAQ composite. So I just type into the ticker IXIC and hit return. Looks like somewhat of a roller coaster. And as we expand out into the five day and one month views, we're still seeing a lot of volatility. This is a perfect opportunity to use our financial research agent to shed some light on how investors should proceed given the behavior of the market over the past 30 days. Let's ask, which sectors within the NASDAQ have shown the most resilience over the past 30 days? After we hit return, we see our agent getting to work and keeping us surprised of every step in the workflow here in the chat window. And what does that workflow look like? Well, it's a bit more complicated than the simplified version we saw on the previous slide. On the left, we see our AI research assistant interface from our analyst dashboard. We provide a research topic and our agent sprints into action. The agent begins by generating a plan. The planner agent creates a list of five to 15 search engine queries to conduct the online research on the topic at hand. After the web content has been collected using the search queries, a financial writer agent summarizes the retrieved content with help from a fundamentals analyst agent and a risk analyst agent. And to wrap things up, a verification agent reviews and determines the accuracy of the summarized report. And once the agent has generated the report, it's ready for viewing in the dashboard interface. Now let's talk about Weave. You saw the agent at work and you saw the workflow. Now let me show you how Weave captures all the important data the inputs, outputs, metadata, and code will you develop, evaluate, and optimize your AI agentic applications. This trace at the top is the financial research request we just submitted a moment ago. And I can scroll all the way over to the right and you can see some of the aggregated data. Total tokens, total cost, latency, and trace size. And when I click on the trace, you see the comprehensive trace tree and all of the input and output data for each agent in each step of the workflow. This comes in especially handy for drilling down into the LLM API calls so I can see everything that was sent, including the prompt and configuration settings, and everything that was received in the output. Here we can see those searches that were generated for assignment to the financial search agents. The trace tree shows you the agent's step-by-step -step operation. The default view shows you all the tasks completed by each agent, and you can use this slider at the bottom to scroll through the timeline of task execution. We also have a couple of other trace views that are incredibly useful for examining agents and agentic workflows. This is the code composition view. It organizes traces by grouping and nesting traces within the agent by which they were called. This allows us to quickly visualize how the workflow plan has been executed, which tasks are most closely related to one another, and take account of the aggregated metrics for each task in each group, including total number of tasks executed and the total latency. 
The flame view is an interactive chart that allows us to not only visualize the agentic workflow, but effectively navigate through it and drill down on any task of interest. This layered view allows us to quickly identify concurrent activities, bottlenecks, and dependencies within our workflow, providing deep insights into orchestration, handoffs, performance, and efficiency. So, now we've learned that agents like our financial research analysts that may appear somewhat simple on the surface are actually fairly complex. It's not a ton of work to quickly build out a multi-step workflow consisting of LLM calls tied to one another. But building an agent that can be confidently deployed into production is not easy. Why? Agents are prone to make mistakes that humans wouldn't make. This is largely because LLMs, the underlying engine for our agents, are non-deterministic. This results in unpredictability. If asked the exact same question a hundred times, they can never be depended on to consistently return the exact same answer. And finally, agents in agentic workflows are complex and opaque. It's challenging to understand exactly what happens in each task, how long it takes, and how it relates to other tasks. But this knowledge is critical when developing a production-ready application. And this is where Weave comes in. Making agents easy, or at least easier, to productionize. By adding just a single line of code, Weave tracks and organizes all of your agent inputs, outputs, code, and metadata, allowing you to rapidly iterate. Weave helps you optimize AI agent performance simultaneously across multiple dimensions, including quality, latency, cost, and safety. Weave equips developers with a playground for prototyping and testing agent and application LLM calls, interactive trace trees like we saw a moment ago that organize and display all of the most important information to investigate your agent at work, a flexible framework for conducting the rigorous evaluation process required for building bulletproof enterprise-grade AI agents, and finally, guardrails to protect your brand, your agent, and your end users. Weave is purpose-built to support every step of the agent development workflow. Examining our financial research agent provided us with a glimpse into the power of Weave when it comes to the iterate and deploy steps. Let's rewind things for a moment and take a look at the prototype step, building the first version of our AI agent. The process of developing an agent has got to start somewhere. So let's start at the first step in our financial research agent, generating search queries to conduct the research required to write a report on a requested financial topic. We'll start in a notebook with some Python code. This is a single task in our agentic workflow. An LLM call requesting those queries that we can then assign to individual financial search agents to perform searches and retrieve relevant information. As you can see, we've added our one line of code initializing Weave, and also a weave.op decorator to enhance our collected trace data. And after we've executed our call, we can jump directly over to Weave and see the call here on the traces page. Clicking on generate searches, we can see a list of all the queries that have been generated. And we can also click on the LLM call itself and then move that into the playground for further investigation and quick iteration. And when it's time to move on from prototyping into considering which LLM and agent candidates might belong in production, we use Weave evaluations. Before we deploy an agent into production, We'll run evaluations on the entire end-to-end -end workflow. But first, we need to start with evaluating each task individually to make sure each part performs as required and contributes successfully to the whole. Here in our notebook, you can see that we're calling three separate scorers to evaluate our generate searches task. Search value score, which evaluates the value and topical relevance of each query using an LLM as a judge. Search Recency Score, which evaluates the temporal relevance, also using an LLM as a judge, as recency and time sensitivity are almost always important factors in financial research. And finally, Search Count, 
which is really just a count of how many queries you're generating. Here we're going to evaluate our agent using three separate models used for our generate searches call. GPT-40 mini, GPT-40, and O3 mini. And once we're done running the scripts, we can jump back over to Weave to check out the results. This is the Weave evaluations page. Here we can see all of the important data from our evaluations runs. But what really brings this information to life is the ability to compare evaluations. Our comparison here shows us that O3 Mini performs the best over all of our evaluation metrics. As production candidates increase, this type of interface that allows you to compare and diff every single option is yet another example of how Weave organizes and puts all of the data that you need to iterate, optimize, and make critical deployment decisions right at your fingertips. In addition to the evaluation process, our agentic workflow also includes a verification agent that acts as a meticulous auditor called upon to verify that the report is internally consistent, clearly sourced, and makes no unsupported claims. The presence of the verification agent provides an added layer of protection against delivering results that may be problematic into the hands of our analysts. In the case of the report we requested at the beginning of the demo, the verification agent has given it a passing score, while also pointing out that there's still room for improvement. In situations where the verification agent gives a failing score and determines that a report is inadequate, we can add to our agent's planner instructions to discard the report and begin anew, or direct our financial analyst to ask an administrator for assistance. These verification pass-fail scores can also be easily recorded inside of Weave and used to filter the data for further analysis or added to future data sets for evaluation or training purposes. While our demo today is focused on WMB Weave and the prototype, iterate, and deploy steps, the Weights and Biases AI developer platform plays an instrumental role at every point along the route while circumnavigating the agent development workflow. And as we continue to observe our agents in production, we're always thinking about potential updates to improve the application and the end user experience. We refine, optimize, and add new features. And using Weave, it'll be easy to measure the impact and performance of these enhancements. Thanks so much for your time and we invite you to sign up for Weave today, the first step in building and deploying your AI agents and applications with confidence.